Hong Kong Island has been undergoing rapid development. The existing drainage system can no longer keep pace with the current development. To alleviate flooding risks, construction of the Hong Kong West Drainage Tunnel by the Drainage Services Department is now in full swing. Despite any slight inconvenience, let's support the Drainage Services Department to get prepared against the flooding risks. Hong Kong Island has a hilly terrain. Rapid urbanization has rendered northern Hong Kong Island vulnerable to flooding. To alleviate the flooding risks, a major flood prevention project, Hong Kong West Drainage Tunnel, at an estimated cost of 3 billion Hong Kong dollars, commenced in November 2007. The concept is to intercept stormwater at Mid Hill. The surface runoff in Mid Hill will first be intercepted at the intakes then flow along the drop shafts and edits to the main tunnel and finally be discharged into the sea. The main tunnel extends from Taihang to Cyberport. To intercept stormwater, a total of 34 intakes are built. The interception of stormwater can reduce the amount of stormwater flowing into the downstream low-lying areas. In this way, the flooding risks in northern Hong Kong Island can be relieved. Dear Director of the Drainage Services, how do you do? There is a construction site of the Drainage Services Department next to my school. Today, my teachers invited your department to tell us about the Hong Kong West Drainage Tunnel Project. Now I know how much the department has done to prevent flooding. I once saw the scene of flooding in northern Hong Kong Island on TV. At that time, I was really worried about my friends living there. Flooding could cause so much inconvenience and even life hazard. <laughs> Okay,大家小心,黑雨。整條路就是水浸,水浸下來的水 I think to solve the flooding problem, one way of course is to uh, build uh, drainage works uh, in downtown, in central. That's not very practical because of all the activities going on in central. We are adopting now is an upstream diversion method. So the idea is to divert the storm flow away from the downtown. And the way is an uh, effective and environmentally uh, friendly way and uh, economic uh, method to um, solve this uh, flooding problem. I think in the long run, it will be a good thing for the city and it's worth supporting. But for such a mega-scale project, will it affect our living environment? The Drainage Services Department has conducted detailed environmental assessments early at the planning stage to ensure that the implementation of the drainage tunnel project will not give rise to any permanent adverse effects on the environment and ecology. The department also cares about temporary environmental impacts during the construction stage. Apart from noise control, air quality and water quality are closely monitored at regular intervals. The department will ensure that the work will comply with the legal requirements. Moreover, greening and waste material recycling measures will be taken. Trees within the site will be maintained or transplanted in the vicinity as far as feasible. Upon project completion, new trees will be planted. Now I know that flood prevention projects had greatly helped people living in northern new territories. Mom and my teacher often say, 
we should help others and be considerate. Hence, we should support the project which is beneficial to the community. We pass through the Central District, mid-level, almost every day. And during the heavy rain, you can see waterfalls along the hillside. We must do something as quickly as possible. As a lay person, I would have to trust the experts. I would be hesitant that they should do their best to maintain these disturbance and, more importantly, maximum safety. Our citizens should be a bit patient while the whole progress is being done. Upon completion of the project, the loading on the existing downstream drainage systems will be greatly relieved. The flooding risk in northern Hong Kong Island will thus be alleviated. Thank you for your efforts to make our lives better. I will ask Mom, Dad, and all my friends to support you. I hope that the flood prevention project in northern Hong Kong Island can be completed smoothly and quickly. Dear Ching Lam, on behalf of my colleagues in Drainage Services Department, I would like to say thank you for your support. During the construction stage, we will do our utmost to minimize impact to the public. However, some inconvenience will be inevitable during construction. Your support, understanding and tolerance are indispensable. We will also strengthen our communication with the public. In addition to consultation with schools and incorporated owners associations, we have launched various channels to communicate with the public. Our colleagues will strive to complete the drainage tunnel project as fast as we can.